All right, welcome everybody. This is Cellular Pawn. Um, I haven't done one of these videos in a really long time, uh, three years ago to be exact. Uh, but usually I make one of these videos when um, it's really needed. Uh, rather, some stuff needs to be said. Um, I'm going to give you the truth about our Sim 13s. And I'm going to go ahead and show you today's working January 22nd uh, ICC ID for the R Sims as well. So I'm currently in a T-Mobile Metro, uh, T-Mobile branded iPhone 6. Uh, you see that the tri you know, the, the SIM not supported is there. I've got a Cricut SIM card in there currently. Uh, it is not working. Now I've tried the one that even R Sim has on their site that has the uh, ending for being 7754. And that is not working. That's also the one that everybody shows in all their YouTube videos as the currently working one. And it really does not. And I'm showing you how this all goes based on me actually doing it. So you'll actually get first-hand look instead of some video or something crazy or somebody showing you maybe a sim stuff out of some other country. Who knows? But you're about to see it. So when all this goes in, it goes there. does the same thing everything else does. I am going to kind of go through this quick because I'm not one about having fast videos because who wants to sit there and watch a video for a long amount of time? So just bear with me in the fact that I kind of run through this pretty quickly because I've been doing this for a very long time. Um, and we'll go from there. Now again, the one ending in 7754 is not working today. I would show you that, but that's kind of pointless. So I'm just going to show you the one that's actually worked for me today. Uh, that's going to be... God, I can't even see the buttons. I have to do this kind of weird. All right. 8901-4104, what are our next numbers, 2792, Ooh, too many twos, uh, 920259, and 5096, so those are your numbers, and I'll put that number set in the description below, and that way then you guys get to see this the way it's intended. The way it's intended to be. Now, I'm pretty sure it's not going to work. I'm probably going to have to power cycle it. But hey, if it works, this will make my video that much shorter. <laughs> All right. And the truth about our SIM 13, as you just got to see, it just went through and everything's good. Now it's unlocked. Now I will reset this phone because I like selling them as T-Mobile Metro down here in South Florida. Metro is one of the bigger sellers. So I don't really have to sell this as an unlocked. And I can sell it for cheaper because it's that uh, locked to T-Mobile. Um, and will work for T-Mobile Metro. But outside of that, the truth about our SIMs. Uh, you see that one RSIM that I put in here, the RSIM 13 SIM chip, uh, or SIM card. This is the same one I've been using over and over and over again. This is the thing that's going to make people happy and sad at the same time. This one chip, one, you don't have to do it. Like, the chips would only be good for, what, one use? You could use it in one, you, and they eventually made them kind of better to where you probably could only have used one to unlock it, but you always had to put it behind the SIM card, so you always had to run one, so you always needed one. In this case, since you can actually unlock these now with the SIM card, take this SIM card out completely, and now you'll see, I'm going to put the entire Cricut card back in. There's nothing behind the Cricut card. It is literally just the basic Cricut card going right back into the phone. It's going to read it. Now, this is not an active Cricut card, but you're going to see it's not going to say SIM not supported anymore. It'll simply just say no service like that and keep us on the screen. If I actually had a working live SIM card, it would actually get bars and everything up at the top here and be fully working right now. So you literally only need to use one RSIM. So don't be silly and buy 10 of them like I did when I first started. Go ahead and just buy one of them because you'll be able to use it on everything. Please note that Apple will probably patch that entire SIM chip very soon because there's I don't see them being able to keep this going very long I and mean, this is this is probably one of the biggest breakthroughs we've seen in unlocking iPhones well shoot probably ever since back when you could jailbreak and unlock through software I mean and this is even easier than that so I don't I don't see Apple letting this fly for very long guys so get these in get them done as much as you can uh, and have fun like my video please uh, feel free to subscribe I am gonna try to start getting more videos and more things out there where uh, I, I just try to help all you guys out. Uh, have a good one. Bye.